I started off needing a forklift for our manufacturing business. We get in freight and we need the ability to move that around and I didn't want to buy a piece of equipment that can only do one job. Once I realized we were going to move out onto a larger piece of property, a uh, tractor is just a natural fit. So I went to several different dealerships. I started at Heritage Tractor because I grew up already having kind of a fondness for the John Deere brand, but I wasn't gonna just look at one brand. So I went to several places and I felt more welcomed at the uh, Heritage Tractor branch. Everyone always felt like they had time to answer all my questions. And then I also drove around the building and saw the size of their service department and kind of got a comfort there as far as the service I would receive. I wanted versatility to be able to fit in a small space, but also still do big jobs. And so I went with the two series John Deere. I got a 2038R. I got it with a mid-mount mower, a backhoe, a grapple, a tiller, box blade, and a set of pallet forks. The number one attachment I use is the pallet forks. That's almost a daily thing that we're moving some type of freight around with those. And almost any tractor manufacturer offers the ability to run the same types of equipment, but the versatility of the 2038R is unmatched because I can switch in seconds between any attachment and I can take the backhoe on and off in about three to five minutes. And I haven't seen anyone else who offers that kind of speed and adaptability. So if you're thinking about getting a piece of equipment like this, it's not a small purchase. So you wanna put as much thought as you can into it and learn as much as you can. Factor in what the dealership experience is gonna be like for you because no matter what you buy or how good of a quality piece of equipment it is, there's gonna be a scenario where you need dealer support. And before you buy the cheapest tractor, just make sure that you're gonna have that quick attach ability that you get with the John Deere because if you're wasting time switching between your different pieces of equipment, then time is money too. So you really wanna factor that in. I've already got almost 200 hours in six months and there's not really a day that goes by that I don't start that tractor.